Ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, the Otaku Hub, and it is me, uh, Kenji, from the Otaku Hub. And, uh, yep, I'm doing my first Nendo review, or my first figure review, and I know I should have started this a long time ago, considering I have a large amount of Nendoroids, and I think two, two scale figures. Um, I'm more Nendoroid, and I have three Figmas, actually. So, yeah, if you want to guess how much larger amount of Nendoroids it is, uh, guess in the description what the amount is. Um, it's a lot, I'll just tell you that much. I'm pretty sure if I ever do a room tour, you'll see they're all opened, unfortunately, just because I know people like unboxings a lot more than they like just, just the plan out thing out there. But that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing. I'll be doing them out more often because I can't really unbox what's already been unboxed. So, yeah. I chose Sakura Miku first because I, I just got her actually. Um, I'm not too far into the whole Miku franchise thing or the whole. Uh, I know she's like the you know uh, first AI singer or whatever, artificial voice. Um, but yeah, I, I always thought she was like a common trend in Japan or people that like Japan. And uh, I have a few Mikus so far. Uh, I have the ones that really are like based on holidays. Um, I got a Winter Miku 2014 I believe um, or 13 I believe it's 2014 Winter Miku. No 2013 maybe. I think 14 is the one that's coming out. It's still the magic one. Uh, then I have um, the Halloween Miku. Then I have uh, the Schoolgirl Miku. And I think that's it for Miku besides this one. Um, and yeah so I'm gonna be reviewing Sakura Miku, and I think I consider this a spring Miku, just uh, the school one I know is called spring version, um, but it's, you know, Sakura flower spring blooming, so yeah, let's see. I chose something that's kind of like, a little more miscellaneous, and I know it's, I mean, it's me, Hatsune Miku is not really miscellaneous, but um, she basically owns an Android franchise, I believe, that's how many Android variants she's got. And, uh, well, for the box, you know, you got your front, and then your side, top, I, I, I'm, other side, all these different poses you could put her in, which I usually like action androids, so I usually put them in action poses, but she's a cutesy android, so she's going to get into a cutesy pose. And that's just fine for me. Um, I heard these a little delicate, so to watch out with those. But uh, check it out. Hopefully, it's just not plastic. Tape, 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 tape. You have tape? Oh. Yes, she has tape. Oh. She doesn't have tape. Oh, and she does have tape. You sneaky, sly little Tapes like attached to your plastic, so it's gonna be hard. Miku, Miku Senpai doesn't want me to open her. And I don't want to force it. It's rape. Alright, there we go. More or less unbox the normal. Uh, right away, she comes with this uh, Sakura petal or flower thing stand. And uh, it's nice. I, I, I like when they come with their own personal stands. Um, puts a lot more to their character. Uh, more importance. Uh, I wish they all came with like a special. Even if like it's the, like the Attack on Titan ones where it's just like the floor with some bloodshed or something. Um, or Black Rock Shooter which is a different color uh, yet again stand. That's perfectly fine. I like that too. Um, she does come with of course the original one. And um... But I'm most likely going to be using this one, probably on top of the original one. Or, if it's not this one, then... Pillows. Um, just because I like that weird little... Look, I'm going to put the pillows on top of here. I shall see. Now, of course, she's got her pillow stand, like I just said. The one that she sits on. Uh, I guess it comes apart. Yeah, look at that, it comes apart. Pretty cool. Oh. 
Wow, okay. Plastic on plastic. On plastic. Ooh, so she is used for me, so she may come with some flaws, but not uh not too noticeable. And anyways it's covered by another. It's covered by another pillow, so it's fine. Leave it over here on this side. Over here. Yes. Um I guess I'll do face. For all your plastic singing Miku needs. This is a Miku uh, plastic cover version. As you can see, her um, her headphones are uh, have this protective plastic layer to uh, to uh, amplify her singing ability. Of course, I, I don't see how this won't help her out. And I'm considering that it might uh, kind of mess up her singing, considering that there's plastic between her and the microphone. But I do not question idols. But just for the sake of it being my Android, I do not want it to be a plastic model. I'm messing with you guys, this, and I, I know this is just to protect the paint. Come on, guys, you've had a lot of Android already so far. I should know something. Nailed it! Alright, just not particularly hard, it's just you gotta. Oh no! Alright, she's got one. She's got one side only now, guys. It's too far for me to reach. I'm going to get it. I'm sorry. Here you go. Sad Biku. She lost one of her headphones. It's my fault she's crying right now. I have you right here. Three hours later. Finally figured it out. Okay. So this one comes with her sad face, I'm guessing. Um, she does look very sad. And it comes with her normal head he headphones. Um, I say normal headphones because it's like a CN. Her actual figure, she's got like these Sakura ones, which of course I'm gonna keep. I mean, normal headphones, come on, I can just go buy the normal Miko for this. Um, if I do recall, her her Maho Shoujo, her um, winter uh, magical girl one, doesn't come with headphones, if I do recall. I don't know, I'll be, I'll be doing a review on her soon, and I'll probably look back to this and I'll be like, hey, she does, but you're a bit of a retard, you know that, right? So, boom. Yeah, this. Right. Carry on. Um, this is my favorite face, I believe, out of all of them. And this is the one you could probably like move around to different characters, like uh, ignoring the fact that her, uh, oh man, ignoring the fact that her eyebrows are pink. Um, yeah, love this face so much. I just love this face. Um, and onto the figure itself. You see, I told you, uh, this is a special plastic singing edition. Uh, one where they kind of obviously show that Miku has no, um, not knowing that, that sound doesn't travel very well through plastic. And uh, she, she goes through her singing career, uh, singing through these little plastic nibs right here. And uh, it is hard, it is hard as, a, as an idol to, um, to make it out there when you have your Nicki Minaj's. And, uh, yeah, it's okay, maybe, one day. I, I, I'm not going to figure out to put that one, how to put that one on, but don't worry, people. I have leg talent. Got it. Hopefully she doesn't come with too many flaws. Um, and I don't mean by, like, her herself, by the fact that I bought her used. Um, but Ami Ami has a good, um, I mean, she was A. So, I'm pretty sure she's fine. Uh, Ami Ami has a good not giving you crap type of thing. Uh, so, yeah. So, she's got uh, these little, obviously, to make a little square things. Um, I don't know if they come out. I don't want to test it out. I'm pretty sure, actually, they do. Uh, unless it's this headset that, this uh, heads that, um, puts the cherries on. Alright. Yeah, one of them she should put her cherries on. I know it's not this one. It's this one. I think that's what those holes are. So sad face, I will be using your head. By the way, she comes with like a little cat smile. She usually comes with a cat smile face. I don't know if you can see it. Focus on Mika's face. Now, I'm not really, but, but, there. 
And yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, I don't want to touch that. It seems to be falling out. Oh, Miku, please don't. You're 16. Um, I like the whole pink thing. It's really nice. Um, compared to all her other usual blues and occasional greens and occasional Halloween and occasional. Okay, let's just say I just, I just like the pink look. And um, the little cherry things are pretty cool too back here. Just I feel like if I touch them even more, they'll they'll fall off. Um, she's got a really metallic, shiny look with like all her little some parts of her clothing. Blah 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 blah. And uh, her bow tie, bow tie, her tie, and her pants. Oh, what the heck? See that people? I know, I know. I'm not supposed to be showing no 16-year-old panties, but. They're very detailed. I must show the detail. So, now that we're that close, she didn't have her hair on either. Little rose, uh, rose, little um, Sakura flower headset. Because what well, idols? Well, who's an idol without a headset? You know, nobody. Um, of course, she doesn't lip sync. Uh, sad face, up close, personal. Very sad that I dropped all her stuff. And my favorite one. Now, continue on with her stuff. She comes with these two little hair pieces, which are obviously to be put on her hair. Just little cherries. She's a cherry girl, obviously she's pure and innocent. And more legs. Two bendy legs. Bendy. Come on here. For your for leg bending purposes. Whichever those are, be be it you be a bad person or a good person. God is watching. Kamisama, as I should say. And two bendy arms, which Miku, I question your innocence when you um, when you live in the thug life because you know striking that O1 tattoo. By the way, these are very detailed. Whatever those thingies are, it looks like something from Backstreet Boys. Uh, uh, you have to remember Larger Than Life. I know I may be a little old, but do 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 do. The operating arm things. Continuing on, we have get out of here. Uh, a suku de flower, which is very detailed, very beautiful, and I don't think she'll be holding it for me because I want her in a different pose. But I will be showing you a pose with it. And favorite one, the rice cake thing. My jigger. With one hand on there. Detachable hand. So yeah. I'll be putting in various poses and then I'll be talking about poses. Of course I'll be skipping the whole pose thing because of sake of me being a bit of clumsy and I'm, I'm, I'm bad at putting things together guys. I'm bad at putting things together. Miku says bye. And that's how it sound like if I had no sound at all. This is silent film Nendroid reviewing where you will not know anything in terms of articulation and wibble de wobbles and the, 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 the stuff. Of course I didn't go through articulation as I just reminded myself through that little comedic thing that failed, obviously. Um, yeah, you get your, you know, to do's and that's. I mean, if you had a Miku before, kind of the same thing. Your hair moves around, though these kind of get in the way. Um, wobble de wobble de wop. Blue, what are you saying? You know, head up now. Even though her head for me is a little loose, but not so loose where okay, well, kind of loose, but not so loose where it'd probably give me issues. I kind of gave, went with this whole like, hey, yeah, how's it going? Pose. Um, where she's just out there. 
you know, showing her thing, you know, all over the, all to the, to the whole world, her uh, cherries, and um, these I'm really scared about these. I, I like do not want to get anywhere near these. I feel like these these are the cherries I, I heard that that were delicate actually, not these. These aren't. And not, well, probably like this part of these cherries, but not the top, not the insert. And that insert, my sir, my good sir, is very well delicate. Now, uh, yep, I did this go happy go lucky pose. Um, and uh, it was kind of hard to get the, this headset along with these uh, uh, cherry things on top, which are you kind of have to switch the head to the other one you get so that you can put the cherries on top. Then you gotta take out these, you see this little, well, see these little things right here? Well, you have to kind of uh, take these off of these and then put them into those. And unless you just take the ones that are already in here and then put those just straight in. But um, I, I really don't, I just took the those hair pieces off. Um, to put this headset, I had trouble putting it on just because it didn't fit in too well. So what I took is the front piece from the other one and put it onto this one and then it worked. I don't know if you need to do that but uh, it worked for me for just doing that so yeah so this is you know obviously being Sakura Miku you want her all sakura out this is the way you all sakura out her um, well look in terms of the head the body she's not really she's just like Disney World you know and um, I gave her a bendy leg she looks bendy with the smile on the and this is probably the wrong leg this is most likely the wrong leg yes actually it's the right leg just for some reason the smile is this side yeah cause I think this leg is I both the same nope it's the wrong leg nope they're both it looks fine okay it looks fine. I didn't know it's the wrong leg. It probably is the wrong leg. Derp. Well, next pose. And here she is. Um, this is kind of like a sad that nobody else wants to smell her petal because who doesn't, you know, want their petal being smelled? And um, essentially, I'd stand her like that. Though she would fall, very evidently fall. Oh, then again, you have her right up. Let's see if I can do it. One handed. No, I'm very scared of her falling. But her hair can do the job of keeping her up. And that's what this is being used for. Or you could use it for sake. If you don't care for it. Um. What can I say? Cute. You know, sad face. I really don't have a lot of sad faces actually. Um, so I welcome it. Though you don't want to see ever see a woman sad. You like the variance of emotions. And they are figures. So there's that variant. Um, or that thing, my dear. Altogether, I think she's a very good android. Oh, I do have one pose, and I will talk about her at the end after this one pose. So, sad face? Good. I like it. Let us continue! And final pose, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, my favorite, her sitting down with that derpy looking face. That's the face I have when I get another android, or when I was announced that High School TXD Season 3 came out, except it was more like a climax uh, satisfaction Tory face you know the ones you kinda see in those the weird enemies called Hinties yeah those and well as you can see uh, you sit her down with the straight legs and uh, me holding her is not doing any justice um well ladies and gentlemen Hatsune Miku uh, Sakura Miku um very good Nendroid I personally like how colorful she is she definitely screams Sakura um, all her stuff together, boom. Uh, this being one of my favorite things about her. Um, the whole weird new, st uh, the whole personal stands, of course, and then pillow ones, and yeah. 
beautiful for an Android in itself. Um, I personally like it. I, I'm, I'm going to have it, of course, displayed. I have all my Ninjas displayed. I don't keep them in boxes, even though I, I, it's justifiable to keep them in boxes. Um, I understand people who do. I keep my Amiibos currently in boxes. Um, loving it. I will be doing more Nendor reviews. I'll possibly be doing one right after this, so you'll get two Nendor reviews in a day. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe if you want to. This has been the Otaku Hub. I'm Kenji, of course. Uh, like, bloom, bloom, blub, blub, spread the love. Shabloople. We have a Twitter. It is called the Otaku Hub, so you can go over there. I'll be tweeting. Uh, I'll start to be tweeting. <laughs> I haven't been tweeting at all, but why tweet when there's nobody there? Um, to listen to your things. And the real show of this uh, review, of course, is none other than over here. Uh, this Sakura Miku has all been a hoax, people. This is not what I really wanted to show you. I wanted to show you Ghost Rider in a bunny form. As you can see, the articulation is not visible. Sorry for showing you this.